quad you're back. Assembling the frame is where things really start to get exciting in our quadcopter build. In this build I'm going to show you how to put together an alien frame and we chose this frame for three reasons. Number one, it's a very simple frame and anyone can put it together. Number two, it's relatively inexpensive and number three, it's got lots of room for your components. So let's get started. So let's open the box and see what comes with the Alien Quadcopter Frame Kit. Okay, we have our booms. package of hardware, another package of hardware, another package of hardware, a battery strap, and I don't think we'll use this particular battery strap, we have a better one, and then a camera mounting plate, a bottom mounting plate, And a top mounting plate. Okay, let's start putting this together. Okay, to start with we're going to mount the booms to the top plate using the smaller of the two uh, fasteners that were sent with the kit. But before we do that we want to swap out these drab red and white booms For a pair of custom booms that we've previ previously spray painted black and yellow to give our quadcopter a sort of a custom bumblebee look. Now if you're going to spray paint the booms you want to take care to uh, cover over the brass inserts for the fasteners. You don't want to get them all plugged up with paint. And you can do that simply by either masking off the boom or by taking a spare fastener and inserting it into the brass hole. Okay, one thing that you're going to need is your own set of Allen keys to put this kit together because it doesn't ship with Allen keys. We'll start with the top plate here and the rear boom. And what I suggest is you just put everything together finger tight to begin with so that you can get all of your mounting holes lined up. Afterwards, you can come back. and tighten everything up. So the top plate holes require four fasteners per boom. Like that. Now let's continue putting the other booms to the top plate.
take our top plate, or our bottom plate, excuse me, and our camera mounting bracket, and we'll fasten the camera mounting bracket to the bottom plate <clears throat> using the four rubber grommets. And that's pretty simple. You just pinch the rubber grommet and then pull it through the slot like so. Now we've got our camera mounting plate fastened to our bottom plate and what these rubber grommets do is minimize the vibration from the motors and the propeller uh, to any FPV equipment that we may want to attach in the future. <laughs> 